I just decided why don't I just record another video uh, have a little plan for this video and here we are I think this quarantine time have made people miss the communication a lot the idea of me creating this video What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to another day, another vlog. Today is currently Sunday and you might wonder why I'm recording on Sunday because this week was totally, totally random. I recorded all of my footage of this week randomly. I just picked up the camera whenever I want and I just recorded like a bunch of like things and it doesn't fit together and doesn't make any sense it's so messy and it's unorganized so I just decided why don't I just record another video uh, have a little plan for this video and here we are okay I will definitely roll a couple of footage uh, on this video for you guys to watch because some of those is good you know it's not all of them it's just most of them it doesn't make any sense to, if i group it together so i would put that on side and i will roll a couple like clips on this video and maybe i can start it now
Okay, so what do you think about the first clip? Um, probably I picked up the camera on Thursday or Friday. I just felt like I want to pick up the guitar and play and record that at the same time. And let me know what did you feel when you hear that song because when I played it, I don't know what I feel. Like I don't know what is a word to actually describe that feeling. And so I takes a little bit of time to actually figure it out and I have to ask my friend in order to like kind of get the answer for it because I can't get it myself since I already don't know what it is in the language and so I don't know how to say it out loud. So they give me a lot of like answer and I think most of them really negative like hopeless and like sad and all that you know I would I wouldn't like disagree with them but at the same time it's not exactly what I feel I think that when I, I mean the song sounds a little bit sad but what I what I felt at that time was that I was missing something you know what I'm saying I was missing something and I think this quarantine time have made people miss the communication a lot and I would say I certainly don't like to have this kind of virtual meeting I wouldn't say at all but like mostly I don't like it because in my mind I still picture me talking to my computer instead of talking to my friend you know they are different like the in-person kind of interaction is like we greet each other we give each other handshake, we hug each other or whatever like scenario and like the kind of relationship we have uh, with each other we will act in a certain way but we have that kind of like reading and like you know it's really different than having people meeting each other online I would definitely think that it is what it is now it is what is happening now and we have to adapt with it let me tell you what at the beginning of this quarantine time it was my hardest time that i had ever felt i was having a really stressful time that i literally just crashed out after i uh, finished my homework or finished my day to be honest and i'm sorry about the background noise anyways i start off my quarantine time with a really stressful time it was my final weeks it was the heavy workload assignments from my school and it was like a lot of work from my jobs as well and it created a lot of lot of stress and at the same time, I have to deal with my personal business and that make even harder for me to deal with it. But I was able to somehow manage it to make sure that I can be back on track. So after the first week, I got literally crashed down. I have to go to sleep at, the, at like 8 or 9 o'clock, which I normally only go to sleep at like 10, 11 o'clock. My parent called me at that time and I was like a little bit upset because I was trying to take a nap or trying to get some more sleep so that I can heal my mind a little bit more. So that was really tough for me. And so after that, after the winter quarter and everything kind of like lift off a little bit, my school load kind of like lift off a little bit even though i still have a lot of like workload for my jobs but still i was able to manage all those things so it was good during that time and start off my spring with a positive mind and that was like my favorite one of my favorite uh, quarter that i ever had because i was able to figure out what i kind of interested in a little bit more that is creating videos like this. That's why I am here talking to a camera, talking to you guys. I think that is like a um, successful quarter. During that quarter, we created a lot of events. We created a lot of like videos, just kind of try to promote the event out to students. And so I was able to actually edit my video and other videos for the office. So 
that was that was like a great time that I had. So I would really appreciate the International Education Office for giving me giving me that chance to edit the videos and stuff like that. And they trust me for doing that. That's just like a great experience that I had in spring quarter. And I actually had the idea of like making videos like way back then actually I, I recorded a lot of like videos on my phone when I was like two years ago or three years ago I I went on a trip I recorded it I put it into Final Cut Pro I edited it and I, I put out a video I don't have that right now because that account is got deleted because of the scam and back then I was into videos a little bit not too much but kind of record something take a pictures and do all sort of like photography videography and I was trying to like create some sort of like of videos and that was fun time but I don't have more chance to actually doing that and now I've been figuring out like I like to create videos more so the idea of me creating this video is because I want to create a community that we can all share our thoughts, our experience. It doesn't matter if you are an international student or you're a domestic student. We can share our experience to each other. We, you know, it's just a community where you can open yourself and do more things. And that's how I, that's why I want to start this channel. I want to bring the community to each other, with each other and have a conversation like a normal friends, you know? So that's my intention of the channel. And so I think that is the end of this video. And, um, oh wait, hold on one more thing. I forgot about it. During the week, I, I recorded like the vlog that I made my lunch and I think it looks really good. So maybe I'm gonna roll the clip it right now so you guys can actually see it. And let me know in the comment section down below. What do you think about it? It just looks so good. And I just want to share it to you guys. And here you go. Let's start the clip. What do you think about it? Uh, probably, I I just started to kind of like record some of the B-roll, you know, just kind of get into it a little bit recently. Not a really kind of like fancy vlog or B-roll, but hope you guys enjoy that clips a little bit as much as I enjoy creating it and putting it together. So that is the end of this video. Let me know what you think about the guitar let me know how you're feeling during this quarantine time and let me know did, how did i do with the lunch time like i was called lunch time and uh that's it i will catch you in the next video peace